Welcome to another episode of Explore UMTC Season 2. After this episode, you will be fully charged with knowledge. I am Chief Engineer Florence Nicolas, and I will teach you the proper way of tube charger maintenance. First thing first, what is a turbocharger? A turbocharger is a centrifugal compressor powered by a turbine and driven by an engine's exhaust gases. It benefits lie in the compressor increasing the air mass entering the engine by force induction, resulting in more excellent performance for either or both power and efficiency. Aside from that, we can use turbochargers in various applications of propulsion units, generating sets, diesel and dual fuel engines such as liquefied natural gas, and methanol engines, lastly, the heavy fuel oil engines. Nowadays, different turbocharger makers use inboard bearings or plain bearings which MAN uses, or another maker. Rather than ball bearings or roller bearing double rows for more advantages. Let me show you the silencer. Where the air suction filter had fitted, it prevents foreign object damage that can cause a severely clogged air filter, prolongs the time it takes to clean the charged air coolers, and helps to improve fuel consumption. Next is the compressor wheel, which is generally made of lightweight aluminum. During operation, this wheel spins at high speed because it is coupled to the turbine rotor shaft, suctioning air, compressing, and pressurizing it, and forcing this air through the compressor, casing, and diffuser, and into the engine charged air cooler. Wet cleaning can be performed on the compressor wheel at full load. Then, the post-lubrication tank is connected to the engine's lube ball system. The lube ball pressure is reduced to 1.5 to 1.7 bar. If the engine is shut down or experiencing power failure, the post-lubrication tank realizes the turbocharger's lubrication. The oil flowing out of the tank reduces the temperature of the bearings and avoids metal-to-metal -metal contact. Another one is a turbine wheel, which extracts energy from the main engine exhaust gases. Dry cleaning can be performed on the turbine wheel at full load and wet cleaning at reduced load and temperatures. Last is the nozzle ring, where the expand gas coming from main engine exhaust gas. And there is a different angle for this, that the exhaust gas will strike the turbine blade. That's it! You are now familiar with proper maintenance of turbochargers. Whether you want to advance your career, enhance your skills, or stay ahead in this ever-evolving industry, UMTC offers largest upgrading engineering courses designed for you. If you want to embark on a brighter journey or advance your maritime career, visit our website umtc.com.ph and enroll in our courses. Remember to like this video and subscribe to our channel. Bon voyage!